sure Larry Bird has told his guys, you know, we got a couple tricks here. We can foul for possession or don't foul on a three. If it gets late, the, the Pacers can foul to put him on the line. Ward had it tipped. Johnson made a good catch. Johnson is fouled. Knicks versus Pacers, game three at the Garden. Down by three with 11 seconds left. Draw up the play for us, Chris. It was the same play that we ran, but they double teamed Allen. Allen came down from the screen from LJ, and they double teamed, so LJ fought back to the wall on the baseline. I think it was in front of the Pacers bench. Right in front and, of the Pacers bench. Yeah, he was at least, what, 30? Well, that's what Steph Curry shoots from now, but. Uh, 40 feet, at least 35, and I can't believe I think it was Antonio that was guarding him. Either him, one of the Davis brothers was guarding him, and I'm like, I know they go back off, and well, we got a shot, but LJ shot it like he shoots a regular three, and when that thing went in, man, I had to go to point guard mode and let LJ know, look, we got to make this free throw. All we did was tie the game. And if you ever watch the film, he's all excited, and I'm getting ready to get excited, but then I go to uh, point guard mode, and I calm him down. Yeah. And the, uh, one yeah. Th the, the one thing about LJ that a lot of people don't understand, he sacrificed a lot for the team. And I was happy for him at the time, and I was able to talk to him throughout the times that we played together, and he would accept it, whether he was playing good or bad, so I knew I can go to him and calm him down which he accepted it and was able to knock down the free throw and the Pacers was history. Well, was that the greatest game or the most electric you ever felt Madison Square Garden? Oh, without a doubt. Without a doubt, man. It, it, it felt like as they hit the shot and like the roof was getting ready to come off. Mm. You know, when the fans jumped up, it, it felt like the, the decimeter, whatever they had with the football games, with the noise, whatever. I think we 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 busted that thing. <laughs> do, you, do you remember what the what the vibe was like in the locker room after that game? You know what, man, we were excited, but we we wanted something more. We were greedy at that time. You know, I wish we would have been greedier throughout the whole season, and we wouldn't have had that. You know, all the troubles of trying to get in. But yeah, we we just wanted more, man. And you know, like I said, I was so happy for him because of his back injuries and all the sacrifices he made uh, offensively for other people to succeed and for him to hit a big shot like that was dope. 